historic grand final. Okay, Pacific on defense, CGN on attack. Maybe the last map, map but it should be CGN's, really, if we're looking at map. history. I, uh, no way to call it. And what Best player I had while coaching? Decider. It depends, man. Uh, Yampi was my favorite to coach, for sure, uh, and probably highest potential. So um, like like him and Ardis probably had highest potential. In terms of just pure mechanics, Scream is really up there, man. But, but Yampi, like, full package, for sure. Jules getting ready to be taken. Finally, the Ardis, Ardis is really good, man. Ardis adds a lot onto a team, and that is a lovely way to start this off. Dude, that was like one of the best I've seen, to be honest. I had the, had the little gap here that people would fall back to. I do think that teams can get really good with uh, Fade, Teva, Nades, and we don't really see its full potential. Big kills picked up. Now four on two. Sheriff into the hands of Jalas and can be a problem. Has the incendiary to try and clear out a little bit more of this space, but Larox's utility is the big one. Dizzy and the wingman. So important to help shift the odds in their favours and tilt the scales. Now that Dizzy has been used that you were talking about and well. Here we go. Straight on the spike. Oh. Oh. Already oh. getting the first two kills, but they've not thought about element. Jalas. Damn, dude, they the win play. this one out as well. And pistol gods. They, they, they went from losing pistol every single time against CGN to go into a 4-1. Very nice. 3v2 retake or 2v3 retake, I guess we should say. Or I should say, CGN only getting their first in the previous map. And I think that says a lot as well when you consider the fact that their momentum has always been such a big thing for this incredibly young team. New to the stages this year and the early util combo as well. Such a nice Yeah, wait, the was that guy peaking? Getting the most was that guy peaking first? It was a 2v4, you're right. Everything falling into place now, CGN. You're right, the, the, the guy the showers drops, peaked so. early, 2v4. Scubsy with the 10 months. Thank you so much, man. Appreciate the tier one. Thank you, thank you. Well, VC Teams is my favorite and least favorite logos. Least favorite is Gentlemates, man. It's not for me at all. Um, favorite logo? Ends up going down. Another player. Yeah, I never even, I never even put enough thought into logos, man. This is the furthest he's ever been. Even that run with Saw last nice year, one of the few players who has been in this position. But from an MVP performance in 2023, it is. We're gonna keep this one really, really clean by the looks of it. Damn, bro. It's so scary. Liquid, the Liquid logo is really nice, I'm not gonna lie. I am scared of horses as well, but the fact that it kind of doesn't look like an esports thing outside of the house, I guess, is always nice. It's even more dangerous for CGN. Pacific playing this almost on the front foot, right? Like just holding the angle is quite advanced comparably to what we uh, could normally see from defender sides. It's the standard setup as well. Viper Utah. Yampi, are you not, bro? I've been there crazy, man. But Rose is going to have a premium on information here. CGN. They're too showers, big, dude. Yeah, the Horn has also revealed the other extremity, and oh. now they're starting to collapse. Both of those players, in fact, folded in half through the TP. Only comeback remaining. He takes a fight, which he wins, but the fight. Okay, wait, we've got to keep an eye on these Byrons because that was very convincing. I like this though. They went for a crunch over towards showers. Just the fact that there's a lot of people over towards showers here. Oh. Wait, <laughs> wait, how did he win that jewel? CGN round. Yeah, they hear the reload, then there's heaven. Anyway, uh, horrible phosphate. Really is. Right, it's an absolute ankle break. Oh, oh boy. Oh my god. Six. Shot down within an inch of his life, six HP. But to take a step back for a second and just break down what we've seen, it was that B long control Horsing for Pacific. Smoke. You get the haunt out early. Rose has the info. Someone and says Sassy is going to Lev. And that recon giving the game up. They wanted I could to try see and crunch, but just a bit of a disconnect, not quite getting the fights as they would have liked them. I think as well, um, a smoke that kind of was right in the middle of it all made it a little bit well, more Lev could pretty much pick up like the old... Most important uh, Lev could literally remake the 2022 loud, yeah, could they not? And they maneuvered quite a difficult task, right? That's the most important not saying they should or would, but they could do it. Um, Sean like, FPS with the Prime, thank you so much, man. Appreciate the 12 months. Thank you, thank you. But it's how quickly he opts for it. Exactly, quickly making it iconic. 
player new to this stage, but like a duck to water has taken it up gracefully. Util towards short again, CGN trying okay, to play some Okay, another big buy around, and, and like We're this is the one where they get the op out. We got info. everyone that gets Walk reset. Pacific. Well, I say reset gets the time. eco. Reacting a similar way. I think with the operator, you've just got to be looking at holding down the sight lines and calling a rotation. I mean, that's what you'd hope for, but Pacific still want to look at the minor details, and you can see the committing players towards that hookup. I think as though CGN looked at stand on the outskirts of a smoke stone and not quite into the site just yet looking to cross the t's and dot the i's but how many i's and t's can you look at right because <laughs> like they're taking their time yeah. and allowing pacific to get into position interesting change on the wall as well they completely yeah we got, we got a wolf uh, so fighting wolf in the site with the showers control Elements it doesn't look like they've heard it they think they can be in lamps longer with the slow it's not a retake that can be set in motion and in fact the horn doesn't even get the reward uh, no gonna get yeah, they did though. not think there was someone on site here. You can see how slightly disconnected they are. Yeah, I think CGN might be alright, man. The the I think, I think CGN are gonna be so same. fine on this map. Uh, Galito with the Prime, the thank you for the 14 rooms. months, man. Thank it's you, thank really you. nice from Benny as well. It, bringing this Sage pick in, a lot of people would have their criticisms and say, look, the reason why you pick an agent like this is because you've not got a concrete game plan other than just stick the wall up and take the site. But instead, it's towards Hooker. They're a lot more aggressive and what he's always said about it is it Curse them, it's over. angles to fight from a different way uh, of, I think it's you know, okay receiving the same situation to most and uh, the counter utility here was spot on as well well as for Pacific has uh, you've got to be looking at Laroc getting that thrash on lane no, uh, contesting run. towards showers and well actually committing the hunter's fury all the way from shot to get rid of comeback from this position but you can see Pacific still won all the, the presence that CGN like to put forward. Dabby has more picks than anyone else in the and competition. And really planning ahead on so this one. surprising that he wants to try his luck nice and early. Shot. CGN lost Absolute to work with shot. still, but the numbers are thinning out. Sharp shooting. Sheriff and Guardian. Loiter still hanging around, but is finally put down. Another weird wall from Benny, but this is what he likes to do. And he will continue to play around it in bench. I mean, look at towards Laroc, has he's nowhere near. I think he's maybe going to go for a TP at the other side of the map. As for now, the two remaining are not combining at all. They're going all on their own, come yeah. back. Yeah, like, yeah, this is what you expect. This I is mean, what he does. I mean, that's the thing, though, right? CGN are just playing together right now. It's simple. This is what he flipping does. Benny puts the wall down, and yeah, you're probably thinking, oh, he's messed up his, his um, A plant wall. No, it's just to give him a weird off angle. He's shoulder spotting from it, and it's what Natank was speaking about earlier, you know, both when he was mentioning the Sage pick <laughs> a little more indirectly in the, the start Yeah, of the and the right people are getting the right kills. They got they got Ray's all, the, they got they Sage res, they got Brim all. You're gonna see Benny doing weird stuff like this, and if you don't have an answer to it, if you don't clear it properly, then you will get punished yeah ultimate's the aim of the game right now is there is a lot coming online and there's a lot to come online like one away is what i'm talking about and interestingly enough hazard there is a sign of weakness shown for the first time from pacific an early timeout from them yeah, I mean that's, that's Turkish, certainly yeah. one way to perceive it, and uh, and look as you but say, did Zeus play? Uh, is Turkish League uh, team called How? Them, how they're feeling in this situation? I think of big timeouts on bind, big moments. These cars love CGN. I mean, I think they just have to build it up, man. That's what they're, they're paid to do. Promotion. Better try build up the uh, comeback. The speeches being given on. Every single side also, you got to remember server. they've they've been cast in tier two like the whole the time, so they've been it's following be the journey. Like so. Loiter, telling their players when they were ten two down, just to focus and to have that team mentality that they've been so good at. Because there's there's been yeah. he's been coaching them for like two years now. He, he had like a period where he stopped, but then they got him back people, for this year. Then they can come back much in the way that they did to win that match. Well coming into it has uh, I mean the A site has probably been the most vulnerable from Pacific that's where CGN have got all three of their rounds now moving forward complete change up now they look to best German player long. see what they can find what? towards the other Nuki, side Nuki is German right or am I wrong 
There's no information that can be taken here early through the fade haunt this Ooh, time. Oh, where's that recon gun? Rock, a little bit more limited. <laughs> Tex? Oh, yeah, Tex. Tex is the one. Tex is the one. Yeah. I mean, so far, a path of least resistance that Pacific has taken. Uh, the angles that they're holding further back, not wanting to contest CGN on the front foot. It's like they were doing on that, uh, that anti yeah, I'll take round, if you remember, Hazza. Yeah. I mean, Lork here is a low. Interesting on the other smoke side on the attack, smoke. They though. They just give it up. It's standard CGN. They'll be committing towards the A side. They're posturing for it. And the dart, yeah, the dart wasn't the best, though. The Dude, look how many orts they got for this well. one. Like I say, you were missing uh, that information collection. That's why Rose Rose It's a really bold round for comeback to play this Still close. And is he just going to all win the all? Back into this flood if they want to help come back on A. Element has the showstopper. He should be the first port of call. Hayden and the Ooh. smoke though has a CGN have no idea. Anguish still low against the boss Kelly. Oh, yeah, very nice. And they only have to use one all into it as well. They're in a really good spot. Click, yeah, click, click is good. That wall will make it even more difficult to get into say and the fact that for the most part, yeah, it's got to retake. I just think, uh, like watching Pacific at the moment, last four rounds, I would love them to just start doing some random stuff like four person walk push somewhere. It, it doesn't look comfy for them playing sites. I, I want them to just start. Start sending it or doing random or stuff for like one minute, one ten. Benny with the res, and to speak of Benny again, three different plants, three different walls. That's why it's so hard to retake against these guys because you never know what the setup's going to look like. And to be honest, I don't think Benny does either. <laughs> uh, no, listen, there's disrespect shown to CGN in this tournament, but they definitely know exactly what they're doing. Different ideas, diversity shown, and I think as well on top of that has the other thing. Yeah, back on um, chamber. To consider. Uh, this is the first time Pacific have been pushed on. Uh, the I don't know, man. I, I don't know what went on yeah. there as well, because I, I would have liked Little to have seen him on Chamber last year anyway, the and then maybe stage. he'll be on Look Chamber now. Chamber buff is... Uh, in their own respective the chamber buff is interesting. It's, yeah. it's pretty strong on some maps. You're definitely going to see on Paul. Uh, and then that might like snowball. So it's always a weird thing with chamber because well you, you got the right player that it looks like the best agent in the game. And I, I think it's, I think it still could have been last year, even with with how it was. But I'm scared of any, I'm scared of any chamber buff because it's always the. The, just the mechanic of being to TP to out and not CGN get traded is too strong. So when we mess around with that, it gets I mean, pretty guys, scary. If you're just gonna jump spot, uh, you can just walk straight through oh, that yeah. orb anyway. Oh, Ooh, does, does get out of there? Ten. You get the kill, exactly. A lot Dude, they didn't spam. The they they ulted here and, and didn't proper spam this. And again, he can make himself useful here. But all the Pacific players have to do is stall this site. They've got two players who've already yeah, and they got all these all odds a, so much map material for the defenders as it stands there should be only one place that they're worried about this execution coming in right now i mean four ultimates to come back Ten on oh my god oh. Hey, this gives them a lot of space though this viper all. yeah the molly lands on his head viper pick gives him a lot of space massive jewel all goes into the pit even though no one's there Ah oh, man, they're not good at this map, man. <laughs> they're not good enough in this map. <laughs> I, I think they actually only get like six rounds or so. CGN beat out the players with a tap of the spike. Nothing comes through, but this is when they begin to activate. No way Davi H was getting out. No way that showstopper was going off. And no way Pacific were getting that over yeah, the way. Every single ult. Still lose it, four routes into a round. It's a worrying sign. Loving it, and you can see why. That is a round that means so much, Cairo. All of the ultimates invested, and no results gained. The Molly from Anguis backside just eyeballs it and lands right at the feet of Lara. Well, it's an absolute shot from him. Immediately silenced. Nothing more that they could do. And now CGN will be feeling confident again. Five rounds on the bounce after what was a flawless anti-eco into that bonus. Listen, the narratives in the, this game can quickly change. Pretty sure that slows them in to go that. CGN need to get what they deserve right at this moment in time. At least an advantage on the next half. 
as they prod towards the east side. Pacific are starting to get moved off the angles and respecting. Oh. This is the stuff that I wanted to see. They, they, they should Ferraris definitely be leaning into this more. Go yeah, the, the, the defense isn't good enough. Then they gotta just random do stuff. But with, with this guy taking so much space here, the, the push over towards showers doesn't massively make sense. I think you just gotta let the other guy play. But at least they flashed in, did it together. To shake. The fans right behind them, but so is Rose. That's the big thing. Rose still lurking in the back lanes. Pacific looking to hold on towards at least back seat. And the reason why this will work is the tentative nature of CGN. They're slow to Ooh, take the yeah. space. I mean, this is a kill for Rose. Rose this is going to give him a fade or he can win this round. Laying in wait to find the back of the head of Element. He is gone. The night fall through. The Prowler off the back of it. Vince condemned. But no way. By his side. They okay, for the round. just though, and at least CGN now know line. that this guy got here uh, early, so, so they pushed out somewhere, so they can just hold their passive out, default for a bit longer. Time, That's what we got to see on this one. No just let's see if the right. communication from CGN That's is good enough for everyone to realize, wait, we got flanked from shower, they didn't make a TP sound, they had to have pushed. So we're just gonna hold you're default. Here, the fight's taken by Pacific Larrock, able to get one on the way out. And what do you think about Tamazi so and Shin getting dropped? Dude, I'm interested to see what K Corp are doing. Um, it it's slightly different to what I thought no they were gonna do. Not gonna lie to you. So I'm interested experience. to see. We'll, we'll see who they pick up. After that one, but they come right back through with plenty else of their if they're dropping, I mean, the right especially Shin, I can kind of... I think Tamazi maybe would have fit better like a different role. Um, I'm interested to see who they get in Shin's position. As soon as you've been exploited on one side of the map, you immediately go there in the next to see what the hell happened. And Means they keep in Magnum IGL. Yeah, that, unless they get another IGL. But, but I think that was one of their main right issues, personally. I mean, uh, but I, I would like to see Magnum go is, Sentinel, but like we'll see. Stacked, so they manipulate other sides of the site. But the thing is, though, Heiser, they're hot on the heels of CGN. Comeback is right next to the TP, but Lloyd's Yeah, it didn't, didn't really hold a default on this one. Okay, they, they at least expected some kind of reaction to the other side of the map, so that was cool. But yeah, and this repush on short is perfect, though. I don't know why they repush this, but then have this. Okay, yeah, there we go. Backing it up for the rest of his team and affording a hefty rotation. 30 now left for this to make happen. And CGN queuing up into a site with plenty of players and plenty of utility to stop them in their tracks. Shot. Ball is expended, Hazza, but the players are also being expended. CGN finding the picks, but the thing oh. most important is the time. Come back Ooh, did he shoot a long here or not? The free, but they'll still Rose sitting in the middle of the site. Ten, Ten seconds. seconds. I mean, Hazza, that's that wall will do a world of good, but they're still trading through. Come back, yeah, Willie just... was coming into hooker. Has to I, I still think the change up from Pacific CGN and like the mid round cool, or at least like midway through the half to be like we need to just do something aggro we're just going to get wrecked if we sit back and wait was good um but yeah cg i mean they got a little bit unlucky with the timing here to be honest or just the duel here again been rewarded I mean, that, you look at that round even it is a late execution wall. i mean to secure the plant the here right situation well comeback wasn't able to get too much value from the flank and then even benny just dropping in the res there for some extra security the wall to stop the two player for goodness sake like it's not standard play but did you really let's replace him for shin is marved <laughs> I, I don't think you understand the uh also, difference between the emea and america's salary for for emea to get an american America, American player in that has already been on like a tier one team, it's just not going to happen. Like, you get the ones like Narrate, where maybe a team like slept on picking him up, and it's like that's his first chance in tier one, but you won't get like a proven America's player just because they're used to three times the salary. The man who bleeds black and gold doing everything for them Thank there. You. His impact being felt in ways which, again, is not simply scanned from the stat sheets or the kill feed. A default this time, as both teams are a little bit more hesitant as to what's going on, because they've both been pushing and pulling. Time to do your tie and shirt back up and 
get yeah. ready for business again. Uh, the reactions and the proactivity from Pacific has been so commendable, but at the same time, the reactionary nature of CGN has also been. Now they go for a lot more spread default, right? Not stacking. Yeah, and here comes the one minute ten push from uh, Pacific time. again. I like this on short. Bro, how are CGN back to back two rounds in, not holding a default waiting for this push? Like, like they did, but they, they still kind of, they give up with that. Maybe a little bit too early here. I like it from Pacific though. Like they, they keep doing a lot better or looking a lot better from these pushes. And like even they're expecting someone to be holding this. Like look at them. Managing to get into the site, Jalassen first to go, and everyone else alongside. Damn, bro, Angus is crispy. Yeah, again, I, I said I think they were gonna get like six rounds. They might not even get six. Because the one thing that has to be said, well, Angus has had his ace in the last map, or the sorry, not the last map, the other map uh, that was played. I'm not seeing him being hitting the highlights like he is on this map. Sure. He is finding what the hell? And the <laughs> Kakuka and in YouTube chat has. Given Gifted 50 exactly. subs. Again, That's crazy. Kuka, thank so you so much for doing that. The, the YouTube really Euler is here. That's Chat, you know what to do. Let's get uh, some, honestly, both chats. Let's get some slug Eulers going in. 50 as well. Crazy. YouTube Euler. Kuka, thank you so much. Thank you, thank you. Many bullets flying, so uh, that's wild. Sure, Finn as well getting involved with the tier one. Thank you for the 14 months, also. CGN playing together. This is the first time YouTube chat's moving too fast. I can't even look at it. Like you were saying, you, you do have Anguist by himself, and another reason for that. Chat, if you were gifted as well, make sure you say thank you. Individuals who can be exactly that self sufficient. Speak of Davi as well being a jack of all trades, how much he offers coming in. But, but this time, Anguist comes up short. And one of so the first times we got one of the opening kills, I think, right? Down by a player and a whole lot of space. The VCT bag. Apparently so. Yeah, Dude, thank you so much again for doing that. Thank you, thank you. There's a big picture starting to be made here by Pacific, starting to be painted. The thing is, though, has a, what is the nature of it? The players of CGN are walking into a trap, and there's so many green. Yeah, and we got the push behind as well. To find their chance at a Don't do it, Rose. Rose surely wouldn't peek that. I mean, Vince is here by himself with the spike, completely isolated in 20 seconds. He goes down, and the ship will sink. It does. Hey, in nice. Fact, I mean, maybe with a five. Next. And that final swan song is there lowered beneath the waterline. Pacific will be the ones on the receiving end of this first half. The advantage is secure. Dude, it's still going. Look at it. Team. Just gifting out. Round Wait, could be so chat, I get free gifts every month, you said, right? I mean, that's it, right? Uh, it's a big gap that could be created in 8 4. Oh, no. How does YouTube work? Be 7 5. I could just checked his map when he was taking the fight. Oh, the reason oh is that what happened there? It. Damn. Yeah, Am I watching America's playoffs? Playoffs, playoffs, playoffs. I mean, but why would you check your map as you're swinging that angle? I, I have no idea. Dude, there's got to be, uh, there's got to be a misclick, right? Info. No, of course. No slight like keybind issue. First time on the stage, it happens. But here we go. CGN hoping this won't be their last on bind. Oh, interesting spot. Some daylight between the two. Showstopper's already done that. Taking the backside space from Pacific, but Showers is where they react. Yeah, I mean, that's the thing you've got to watch out for is Anguist Slate flying, but they're using the smoke again. Yeah, they actually managed to stop a plant CGN as well. They're in a pretty good spot. Smoke. They Having broke the to wall. They put a second one down to get some breathing room. Still, that Showers fight. We're waiting for this to come through. Orbital strike should be the cue for Anguist to take the peak. Yeah. Chilarsen is so wide, yet still Anguist acutely aware. The mosh pit drops into well. Hooker, and the rest of the Gecko utility follows it up. That it's was all a great been play from him. Come back, doing his damnedest. Larok there as well. Oh, hold up, man. Five? Davi the Oops. Oh. The Not again. Music. The recon misses the mark, and the showstopper puts him Ooh, on five? Store. Maybe. Larok will kick him across uh, the Again, I, lo I love that change. Up that they made midway through this to start getting proactive. That was good. They gave him a chance. I mean, has, uh, the lay of the round has been mostly CGN, but the worrying thing is, is they're starting to allow Pacific back into this game, right? That should be so firmly in the German side's favor. Ivan, they're looking confident. Yeah. It, uh, I 
I mean, as give, I him say, a, like, give him another Harvey, pistol here, maybe. A continu continuation of that momentum for CGN. Yeah, that it certainly will. The final round for Pacific. They'll get five before the half time. Can CGN close this or does it all end here on bind? We'll find out after the break. They look a little bit stressed as well. Uh, okay, chat, let me mute. What do I think CGN is doing wrong? What you want to talk about the other maps? They, they, they play, they have a weird play style, man, but it's got them this far, so I don't want to like criticize too much. But it, it's a lot of like individual dry peaks and stuff like that. Like, I feel like a lot of individuals bail them out a lot. They, they don't play normal Valorant, for sure. But that's also okay. You can play like your own style. Yeah, and it's got them this far, top three. Like, that's really good no matter what. I like this playstyle more that they do here with the Sage, to be honest. I feel like this suits them a little bit better. Like the Sage over the double duelist. Yeah, I kind of, kind of got it down these days, Lewis. No wrong. Yeah, sure. They lead by a couple of rounds, but Pacific have started to put their foot down. Kakuka as well, join in the slug club. Thank you for that. Thank you, thank you. 50 gifted. And then your own membership as well. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. Thanks for the support. Better at holding back than I would be. I mean, the, the thing is, Lewis, like it, it works for them, right? Getting this far, it's it's good, man. It's a lot of it's a lot of games. So they're doing something right. Immediately, the game plan is there, building towards the. Whether it's other teams not punishing enough, that that can be like your argument, but at the same time, it's still still top three. You know exactly what Pacific are trying to do here. CGN, you can see what they're trying to do, Hazard, in terms of where the players' positions are. For Pacific, this is a very standard setup and something that CGN should be aware of. They split the A site three out of four times in the playoffs in Turkey. Oh, yeah, not a great way to start Robinson, it. Well, Anguist has held down his lane exquisitely. Already the first headshot coming through. Hoping there's plenty more where that came from. The recon would give him half a chance. It's Element instead that has done the dirty work. Davi there with it, but even trades. Pacific Not another 2v4 pistol. Post. The right. Thing has, uh, been both players are, are completely disconnected. I, I love this though. It shows over towards showers and three position over towards short. To they can, uh, I mean, they got to worry about the wall. It, it's actually down to the wall. Oh, wait, he messed up the wall. Bring out the peaks. It's all coming to the forefront. Larrock has got the kill and it is just a tap. Still selling the no way. 2v4 pistol into 2v4 pistol. How? <laughs> okay, it's 5 1 on the pistols and no joke. Both the pistols. Stools on this have been this. From equalizing that score. I mean, has uh, the anti eco is the time to do it? And um, what does CGN do differently on the defense to get some value, right? Magicians, they yeah, they're gonna they might be messing up here. The, so the wall or oh, the wall was not great. He needed to connect the wall, but then he's scared that someone's gonna jump up See, the wall. But CGN still waiting for their knight in shining armor to carry them through and find a map win here. It, it definitely wasn't a great wall. I, I will say, if we're, if we're just going for positives, though, this reposition from short was perfect. Like, that was awesome. This reposition from long, sorry, I mean. The, play, but the artist wall. Into what Pacific know, and <laughs> Dude, that was still one of the funniest moments, man. That wall at long into the sage slow, that was incredible. Bonus, we would have to find out, but you cross that bridge when you get to it. I actually don't think that gets mentioned well. enough. That was incredible. I mean, the pistols and the sheriffs have what before for CGM, but... It doesn't look as if it's going to be this time. Yeah, the entry's looking so easy for Pacific. Yeah, and like I said, this team, at least on attack, they really don't get equaled totally that much the when they're in control of being able to easier. trade and have the marshal. Invite got lost in the post. Turn up 24 hours later, the gardens are wrecked. There's confetti everywhere. And Pacific all over CGN's parade. 
Yeah, and LaRock can just straight up hunt this through the gun over. Even a death is worth here. Boy, the nade's on his head. From the start, from minute one, that they'll now have in such a huge round. Yeah, uh, it's the macro game plan, right? Uh, they're looking for Lovely. Stuck around action. for it they're as well. We've got Razor getting a little bit close. You've got uh, Fischl for your first buy round. You would imagine that they're still there. Uh, I guess the Thrash, the easiest to get online. And, well, the one that you can find so much value from time and time Yeah, again. they actually really could 3-0 this. And in terms of what the setup is going to try and be here uh jeff well. thank you so much for the bits bro as well thank you thank you such as this, they have shown <laughs> yeah. I, I, I pick my moments jeff don't you worry man happen. appreciate the support dude thank you for saying that showers that key piece of space which we've seen removed from the clutches of cgn round after round did you win the map i mean they lost double pistol the first priorities placed i mean ultimate orbs right that's the thing that tips the iceberg oh, and a great entry from element but is that going to be enough to enter and get the win in the round that's the question that we pose to cgn time they've time and time again has they have let their own slip and he has also used that wall early towards b and it's very passive in terms of information for cgn there uh, this rotation will be late if they look to move towards A. And right now, behind Anguist's zone smoke, we've got a lot of work done. The Thrash is here oh. to bear on down. He gets yeah, the just tape, it. But is there a safety net? Can anyone answer the call? Anguist needing support, an element. Oh, and he got out of it. Picking up one kill. Is one kill enough? Yeah, has uh, Pacifica still fighting their way back in. Ooh. You've got to look at it where just, the last player is. Right, still late and still oh time ticking away. Wait, that's a, a nice shot. That's not even through well. the wall. Another round where Pacific were down a man, yet still look to be in prime position. Jalarsen's found a hat trick. Um, bro. <laughs> so, it he's so Very good. Dude, you gotta, you gotta start buying. You gotta full eco the next round because when this guy gets an outlaw out, it's so, so scary. Yeah, and that's the official definitely helping them out here. Or die. This could be the last map. I mean, there's still rounds to fight in two, but three rounds in a row. Ellison's playing great, man. Doing good. Defense on an eco and a, a broken economy. A another round like that as well, <gasps> where CGN <laughs> have the advantages. Oh boy, they're stressed they out. Very oh, holy hell, they're lost. crazy stressed. And you look at this late round being extremely cagey. It's the exact same as it was last time around. The difference being, Pacific didn't win a single clutch in the whole of that previous best Yeah, of three. and now they've got to go CGN against an the eco. Hand, the guy who needs one orb for his ult for e next rounds is the best gun the for farming so ecos, far. and he's literally probably the best person at uh, hunting ecos I've, I've seen. And I mean that in the nicest way, because they don't get ecos. To bounce back because it's not just showing in the server, it's out of the server to Pacific. Vibe so high, Hazard. I mean, you would expect that being two ma maps up to the good, right? But CGN, uh, they're letting uh, everything show on their faces. It's it's a it's a four-player stack here, though, Cairo. This could be a real confidence booster. CGN have managed to find two kills from it. Benny repositioning under the window of Hooker. So hard to clear. It plays in element one more and he gets sight. one back. But it's a 2v2 when the dust settles and Pacific still in with a chance. Can Anguish find yeah, the man. I mean, this was very, very close. It's all Pacific here. Very, very close. But now they're one away from Brimmel. They, they got Razor online. They're in a solid spot. It doesn't matter how you win the round. It just matters if you win the round. And Pacific, they are just finding value in every Well, meta changing as much as possible. It can't be stated enough. They've had With meta changing as much as with patches coming out, what's my opinion on the role structure for Valorant? I mean, you're definitely going to have like one person, probably two people that can flex a lot of it these days. But I, I think it differs map wise anyway, so it's always been important. It was always going to happen in this game. It's why everyone in Fish 1, 2, 3, like you watch us at the beginning, we, we were one of the teams that were playing the most roles. I wanted to try and extend everyone's career. This is a just because you can't one trick in this game first of all everything was unbalanced also second of all it's like you just look at right games it, it you look at all of these games it's very hard to balance and patch so you've got to be able to flex to some ability even if it's just in your role right you still need to play like every agent or like most of the agents in your role 
Because when, when someone drops off heavy, like a Yoru, and you're a duelist, you know that that patch is coming eventually where Yoru gets patched, so it's good. And it, a lot of the time, it's probably an overbuff. So yeah, it's... um. You just gotta be ready for the future, I guess. Oh, that nade is chunky, right? Three different players that Razor on the fence. Right now, <laughs> no way, what are they doing? Fact, they really the wanted to send it. it, to them. it was the he oh, was that is. There's another flowing through. One player long, that's Loiter. He can't crack the nut. They just can't get in. Wait, are they gonna win this round? There's no way. Oh, this is a criminal round to win. And the last man standing. Benny coming in for support late, and so is Vince. It's a 1v1. CGN calling out for a hero. Calling oh out my for god, gosh. that is Finally close. Considering how this was going, it looked like they couldn't get through the choke point. That was really close. And that's okay, though. Uh, well, I don't know what their money's like. And the question is, is this going to be a deciding factor? That's the problem. We've not even got to this point most rounds. Pacific wiping the floor. And Vince stepping up when he was needed. Alt on both sides. Another big round. <laughs> what the, the hell? What is this in the YouTube chat? What is going Pacific on? Pacific getting caught out a little bit there. They wanted to explode onto B. It was Hooker that they tried. Try and try again. Anguish did everything. Which has Anguish caught. The, the yeah, rate. He's struggling. At least gets the trade through the Viper Molly. But the thing is, though, has a Benny's gone investigating. Dude, look at the money, though. Look, like, look, like, look at this round. Everyone's super low, right? Everyone with a circle round can't buy next. On e shot through that. And Pacific are starting to gather their forces outside of the site. Second slow for Benny. CGN and Pacific both cut down to size. Four players each and that utility dwindling. Here comes the execution. No way. <laughs> There's no way he wins that. He's mid-air, isn't he? Vince has that horrible streak, but I mean, there's a two ultimates, the Vipers pit as well. Davi actually gets come back. Horrible streak in, but... With the recon on top, it's all up to this guy. Oh my god, that is crispy, bro. All up to this guy. Money reset for them as well. No money, kind of worth two. Crispy. They're all so individually insane, man. They really are. Yeah, time out. No wonder off the back of that. You think you're about to be even. Uh, it all goes wrong. Finding double digits. Uh, Capio can't be happy. Neither can Zest. Frustration really should be creeping in. It's just Damn, bro. Even dinged well. him before He's that as well. Off the site. He uses his slows. He knows they're going to be pushing. Stays on the angle. Can't find the kill. And then Laroque advanced into bench has done so much a star in the making yeah this team this team is just so good man on this very stage scary Three team away like i'd be watching this sheet, apex i'd be i'd be scared man of cgn i would be scared their fourth final very much eluding them unless things will change in a matter of rounds and the next one up is nowhere near a pretty sight i mean that's the thing right i mean this is where your bottle is tested. This is when you look to a team and you say, CGN, yeah, you've come back in best of threes, but can you come back in your most important best of five yet? Uh, even if you win this map, right, you still got another two to go. CGN, I mean, has a... I can't even begin to think about the mental state that these players must be in. Uh, look so, at the money so as well. Damn. Ten... 10 8. CGN. They rarely, rarely, rarely get eco on attack. We haven't seen it yet. And the they got outlawed. They got the three good ults for the big buy rounds. If we get to 11 8 as well, then they force them down to like another worse. low buy. It could get worse. It looked like it probably should have. But Anguish has escaped. Joins up with his teammate towards the long side. A little more towards elbow, in fact, but Pacific don't follow through. They're still giving the respect on a round such as this. I mean, the spike might be towards the B side of the map, Paza, but it's not committed to it, right? 
Tabby, she's got nowhere to go and he's forced to TP. Yeah, we've now got one on B solo. Pacific know there's one less player towards this side of the map, and there's four players here for the yeah, attacking I mean, side. I'd be tempted to fade out this early. He's forced the rotation out of element, then he needs to bring one back over. Davi does get out of showers without a scratch on his face, so... Now into the late round again, you've got to be looking at making a gamble, and it's the same default setup run by Pacific, the same late execution, and the same from which CGN were able to find a result previous. So many ults to try and mitigate this, though. That is the big winning factor. I mean, has it a thing about this, though? Spike is still not committed. Well, the ultimates are fully flowing. The thing that you've got to realize is that Spike is nowhere near it. Somehow it's Shot, man. Dude, this guy's come two. alive. V2, 25 seconds remaining, Hazza. And CGN, they need Damn, to bro. Got to ace it. Damn, look at this guy back to back. Huge, man. Back to back. It's insane. Five of the best. And Pacific now only a couple of rounds away. Of course, he aces. The yeah, man. The guy's a beast as well. The guy's an absolute beast. Dude, what is going on? Kakuka, 50 gifted again. 100 gifted today. The YouTube chat's going crazy. Chat, oil this logs. Let's see him. Thank you so much, dude. That's wild. The VCT money, man. It's <laughs> it's here. Two times, yeah. Back to back. And to lose I think that's everyone like in the this, YouTube chat. I don't know. CGN have shown time and time again that they can bounce back. But is this the, the match in which they find no bounce at all? Pacific have certainly got a spring in their step. Thank you so much, dude. Thank you. Thank you again for that. Chatting not to do. Make sure you say thank you as well. Triple Appreciate the support. Bro, they're too crispy. Open. The B long position. Buried in the garden is Vince. There's only two players, you know, either side of the map. Everyone's crispy. Anguist to actually follow up on that pressure. The additional player numbers behind Loiter's fake. But now they want to follow it through. Now oh, Anguis is in trouble there. Yeah, his teammate bailed. Or like, they got to stick together. Either he bails or they both bail. Information and now Davi H, as you said, have the, has the most amount of Hunter's Fury kills. Uh, we'll bring it forward. Yeah, the stall has bought enough time for a full rotate. Rose, the only one there to duel it, and now the bodies are on the site. Well, still to come back, and the players all stuck in CT, moving as a three, moving as a unit. They got one smoke for the spike. Off, Davi H, to hold a read up as well. Thank you so much, man. Appreciate the prime. Setup. Jalassin, he's so deep. He's Thank you so much, Rebo. We'll if he gets another kill, he gets the raise, and it's definitely done. Oh, it's a great Molly. Dude, speaking of Molly, there's a Molly on the spike right now. They can't tap it. Oh my god, bro. They're actually so good, dude. They're so, so good. What's um what's They're CGN's money? In it's in the bin, right? Everyone's sitting around 3k, a I huge guess. Huge round, and that Molly meant absolutely everything from Jalarsen. As you said, the setup was there, and now CGN could be sent home without a single map win. 160 competitive games since the EMEA League was founded. The first German team to set foot on this stage. And they have been silenced by that next generation, the Turkish team that nobody four, thought could. Four chances to finish it. Have. Oh boy, this guy's light armor for sure. Oh, I guess so <laughs> yes, light armor for That's sure. The most important round. CGN are playing for the tournament lives. For Dax, no, he doesn't even get a killer. Someone's walking into him. Engagement's been taken, and Davi H has actually won his Wait, the guy sent it through his own Viper no, the on shore. Portuguese man on the east side. Yeah, they're getting desperate. Oh, my God. Make that two v three. There is a perhaps a chance. Perhaps a chance for CGN. Two v one. Bishop. That's done. Holy hell, man! They three nailed him. They three nailed him. We get a uh, Pacific against Apex. I, I'm telling you, Apex should be scared after watching that. That was nice, and they got the warm up of being up on stage as well. Like they're gonna feel real confident. Devastating for CGM, but gotta give it to Pacific, man. They played so well here. 
banging to the desk as the fans continue 